Hey yo, this is Dash, and um, coming to you real fast. I had somebody on the uh, brisket video ask me how I prepare my chicken. So I actually been cutting up chickens, and this is why it's a little bit of mess here on the cutting board. But before I did the last one, I figured I would show you what I did. So first and foremost, the chickens I, you know, I make, I cook, are about um, four and a half to five pound birds each. All right. <clears throat> make sure it's fully thawed out and then how I start my chickens is I cut them in half um, you'll hear people say they uh, it's like spatcock or I don't know where they cut <clears throat> cut down the back and then they open the chicken up I found it's even easier if I just cut the whole chicken in half so typically I start at the breast and I score it till I get down to the middle portion then I'll come in here and now my finger is inside because I'm kind of holding this, but I'm not trying to cut my finger there. I'll cut cut to one side of the breastbone and now the chicken is open. The spatcock is when you cut it the opposite way. I'll take any extra fat out, toss it. Then I come in, score right there the uh, the backbone I guess the yeah, that'd be the ribs backbones all right now we have the one chicken half and we have the other chicken half this is the back here's the butt gone okay any of these extra organs and things like that that are in here I'll pull them out by hand and chuck them and then rinse the bird out Put it in my container and then I'll see it. Now, when you have extra bits of skin like where the neck was, just cut that off. Throw it away. Because all it's going to do is either it'll burn or it'll just be kind of hanging out after your chicken is cooked. Now it's all cleaned up, ready to be seasoned. And then what I'll do is I'll take all of them uh, and I'll rinse them off one more time. I obviously saw me just put that back down into the into that there. And I'll rinse them all off one more time and then I'll season them. <laughs> 